or die. The Reinecke family wants us to count the total number of SpaghettiO cans. If they complete a book by calculating each letter from the SpaghettiO can. They also want the remainder of letters? So how interesting. with that. Neither am I. I need you to come with me. You're gonna be making that program for me instead. Thank you very much. <laughs> so what is this program you're making for these writing people? It just counts for Wrong! I'm gonna need you to tell the truth here. I can show you the code. Let's see it. <laughs> oh. The book is To Kill a Mockingbird. So in this program, we are using IRStream, FStream, String, and Math.h. We have two functions outside of our main function, letter count and find total can. We have a constant array that has all the total number of spaghettios in a can so that we can calculate the ratio. We have an array of all the alphabet letters so that we can easily list it out when printing out the different variables. And then if you scroll down a little bit, we have the main function which calls letter count first and then find total can. In letter count, we get the file of the book which is two kilo mockingbird. And then we go through the entire book and look at each character in it and determine what type of letter it is and then based on the letter we have another array that adds to the total after we calculate
calculate how many of each letter there is in the book, we find the total number of cans that would be required to write the book based on our ratio of letters. Uh, we do this by having a for loop that starts at zero and then goes through every letter of the alphabet, so 26 times. And the way it works is it takes the it takes the total letters array and then takes the value at i, so it would first start at zero, and then it would divide that by the value at i, again zero, of spat can, which contains the number of the numbers that we found in our spaghetti spaghetti can. So i at zero would be the number of a in the spaghetti can. And then that is inside of a max. So what that does is it calculates whether the value found by total letters at i divided by spat can at i is greater than or equal to the previous number at max num can. And then it takes that value and then it rounds it up using seal and then that, that value gets put into max number of cans. So this whole part, it just finds out the number, the, the highest number of cans that would be needed to write the whole book, and then it rounds it up. And then after that, we uh, see out that value. And then we have a, another for loop that finds the remainder of each letter. And what it does is it takes the value of spat can at i and then times it times that by the number of cans that are going to be required to write the book, and then it subtracts that from the total letters array at i, which is the value that is in the book. So uh, this at a, it's going to find the value of numbers, find the value, find the value of a's in the spaghetti -o can, then multiply that by the number of cans are write, needed to write the book, and then subtract the number of A's that are in the original book. And then it see out the number of letters uh, remaining and whatever that is. Pretty nice coach you got there. I don't like those writing key people, but I'm gonna use it instead. You can just give it to me, you're free to go. very much. Have See you day. next time. Watch where you go. Watch where you go. I'll see them again. Don't worry. I'm Tristan. Hi, my name is Kobe. I'm Hitchman One. Go. My name is Kobe Price. I'm also Hitchman Two. Should we go. Get, should we get Hi, I'm Zainab. <laughs> What's up, gang gang? Time for another drink review. This time I'm playing Mafia Boss in the next hit movie featuring Zainab, Tristan, Kobe, Kobe, AJ, and me. Happy good day. See you later. <laughs>